Hmm. I'm going for a walk today. In fact, I'm about to get down to the lake, which is right over there. And I have a very special friend coming with me today on the walk. And that is Miss Stella. Stella! Stella! Hey, Stella. This is Stella. Hi, sweetie. Stella is a dog from the streets who has been coming and visiting me at the place that I've been staying. And maybe it was against my better judgment, but I started feeding her. Um, and in doing so, <laughs> we've built a bit of a relationship. And in fact, this is the first time I've gone on many walks, and this is the first time she's actually followed me and escorted me. Um, and it's been really nice. And I wanted to share some something that's on my, my heart and my mind. So I'm moving into this new place in November. And I mentioned in other videos that there have been there have been some some issues with robberies, specifically these like kids who are robbing people's houses. And so when I was talking to the woman Maria, who I'm gonna be renting this house from, she was actually encouraging me to get a dog, get a guard dog. She said that a guard dog is the best security system. And so when she was kind of like giving me permission to get a dog and also part of renting her space was that I had to make a long-term commitment. And so for the first time in like, I can't even, I can't even remember the last time I made this kind of commitment. But I committed to a year, to a year in this little house. So I'm committing to for the long term. I'm being encouraged to get a dog and I've been building such a sweet relationship with this with this little Stella here. Um, <laughs> she's very, very sweet. You're very sweet, aren't you? Um, I love the little spot on her eye. Yes, you are. She's very dirty. She's still from the streets. She still has a bunch of fleas. Um, she was much skinnier, of course, um, before. So she's fattened up a little bit. And so I'm seriously considering taking on the responsibility of this creature. It wouldn't be just yet. I still have to go back. I still have to go back to the sea. Come on, let's go to the, let's go to the, let's go to the lake. Have you ever been to the lake, Stella? Um, it wouldn't be just yet because I still have to go back to the States for the month of October to visit my family. And then I'm coming back in November in time for my 36th birthday. Oh, this is our first walk. This is my first walk with Stella. You're so cute. What I like about her, she's very small. She's very small and she's very sweet. So like, for example, like if I need to take her to go get spayed, if I need to like take her somewhere, like I can carry her, which is really nice. Probably one of the first things we need to work on is some some flea treatment and a bath. I I haven't fully like I've been feeding her, but I haven't fully, you know, jumped on the responsibility because it's a big responsibility, and I wasn't I, you know, it's like I I wanted to help her, and I've also been you know giving some food to to the hungry cats that have been around, but I've I've been trying not to get attached, um, but I think I may have failed. I may have failed. Ow. Mosquito bites on my butt. <laughs> um, so I, I didn't like put forward the effort of like, okay, let's go do this and let's get you this and let's get you this because I wasn't I wasn't fully accepting the responsibility for her. So I'm thinking about it a lot if I wanted to accept responsibility for this creature. And I'm kind of I'm kind of thinking yeah. I mean, I'm here in Guatemala for the long term. The only thing is I would be going traveling from time to time, but I was thinking that maybe you've seen in my other videos, maybe not, this guy Aaron, who's a big piece in the puzzle here. He's a big piece in the puzzle here. He, he's really committed to the dog, the welfare of the street dogs here in Sununa. And I've been talking with him. I helped him do some fundraising. He's already, uh, he took that money that we, that we raised through that one video that we did and he built the fence for this dog sanctuary that they're building. So that project is coming, is coming up in a big way. And I was even thinking like, you know, I, if I took on Stella and then I needed to go, you know, travel to Mexico, if I needed to go travel, 
I was telling him or I was offering him the idea that like what if your dog sanctuary was also sort of like a dog hotel for people who own dogs but want to go away and then you, they can leave their dogs with you knowing that they're safe and fed and cared for. Oh, hello. Oh, hi guys. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. Miss Stella will protect herself and she will protect me, it looks like. Hey, hey guys. So these dogs are with that guy over there who's chopping wood. Um, so I was, I was suggesting that to him, that that could be like a, a revenue stream for him to support the dog sanctuary. Um, yeah, so so I'm feeling about it. I'm, my, heart is, my heart is full for this creature, and I think that we could have a lot of nice adventures together. Um, but, you know, it's a big commitment. It's a big commitment. But it would be really nice to have a, a dog friend again. So yeah, okay, so that's where I'm at. Why don't we, well, without further ado, let's let's go back down to the lake. Come on. Oh. Hey, guys. Yeah, so what's interesting is like, I'm also getting the chance to kind of like see her and like test her out a little bit and like, what kind of dog is this? You know, rather than just like, ow, there's so many mosquitoes. Rather than just like, getting a puppy and like you don't know what you're getting you know so we, we've we've had a, a sort of dating period oh gosh this is so beautiful let's come on let's go yay our first walk together Stella isn't this fun and here we are at Lake Atitlan in this beautiful beautiful place on this beautiful day together Ooh. My plan is actually to go sit under that tree right over there, but first I want to show you guys the lake, famous Lake Atitlan. And this, our friends call Secret Beach. I don't know why, it's not really that big of a secret. Maybe if you don't know about it, it's a secret. I like to come here. This is one of my favorite spots. Hey, guys, Stella, have you ever been to the lake? Have you ever been to the lake? Should we go put our paws <coughs> in the water? She's like, get out of here. Okay, all right, okay. Yeah. Are you protecting me? Or are you just being unfriendly? What does this mean? Is this like, is this a good sign? Is this a bad sign? You know? It's funny because before I thought she was like, almost like too nice. Like I went with the cats, like I was, I was putting some food out and she let the cat come up and eat right next to her and the cat like rubbed up on her. What are you doing? The cat rubbed up on her. So I was like, oh, this dog is so sweet. But then since going out and having a little bit more experience together, I, I see she has like a tough side. Like she, she has like a fighter side, so she's small, she's sweet, but she's also a fighter. So, you know, if I'm looking for a guard dog who's going to keep me safe, not that she would fight off people, but she would alert me if there were any intruders, or she would bark at anyone coming at coming in the perimeter. Like, and I think that's pretty, that's pretty good. Did you scare off a pit bull? He's a puppy, but you're a good girl, and you're very dirty. Why don't we go? Uh, why don't we go get in the lake, Stella? Okay guys, thanks for watching, thanks for being with me. Let's go down to the lake. Why not? Why not go all the way? Why not go all the way? Come on Stella, have you ever been? Have you ever been down to the lake? I don't think she has. I think she just kind of hangs out up on the road in kind of dirty places hoping for the best. Look at this Stella. Okay, guys. Oh, get that over there. It's just so gross. Oh, is this your first time going down to the water? Yeah. Where's it go? All 
right, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being with me. What do you think I should do? Sometimes it's hard not to, to love, you know, just to gravitate towards love. All right. Over and out. Oh, look at that guy over there. Can you see him? He's getting, he's getting in. Maybe I can give Stella a bath. Stella, what do you think? Should we try to give you a bath? I think maybe we'll try to give her a bath while we're here. All right. Love you guys. Thanks for watching. See you soon enough.